He is known for his roles as Corporal Rocco Barbella on The Phil Silvers Show and as Eric Von Zipper in Beach Party Films. He is recognized for his comedic talent and memorable performances in both stage and screen versions of Stalag 17. His name is Harvey Lembeck. In the world of comedy, one name stands out, Harvey Lembeck, an American actor whose performances brought laughter to audiences around the world. Born in Brooklyn, New York, Lembeck's talent quickly became apparent. He found early success in his role as Corporal Rocco Barbella on The Phil Silvers Show in the late 1950s, showcasing his comedic prowess and endearing himself to viewers. But it was his role as the bumbling, overconfident biker, Eric Von Zipper, in the beach party films of the 1960s that truly catapulted Lembeck to fame. With his iconic leather jacket and exaggerated mannerisms, he became a beloved character in the hearts of fans. His comedic timing and physicality brought unforgettable moments to the silver screen, cementing his status as a comedic legend of his time. Beyond his memorable roles, Lembeck also displayed his acting abilities in both stage and screen versions of Stalag 17. His performances garnered critical acclaim and showcased his versatility as an actor. Not only did he have the ability to bring laughter, but also to delve into deeper, more dramatic roles. The impact and legacy of Harvey Lembeck continue to live on. He left a lasting impression on the entertainment industry, inspiring future generations of actors and comedians. His children, Michael Lembeck and Helene Lembeck, also followed in his footsteps, further solidifying the Lembeck family's contribution to the world of performing arts. Harvey Lembeck will forever be remembered as a comedic genius who brought smiles to countless faces and left a timeless mark on the history of entertainment. In Brooklyn, Harvey Lembeck was born with a passion for performing. After graduating from New Utrecht High School, he wasted no time in pursuing his dreams. In 1939, he found himself dancing his heart out at the New York World's Fair alongside his partner, Caroline Dubs. The two of them formed a dynamic dance team known as the Dancing Carols. Little did he know that this would be just the beginning of his journey. Despite his initial interest in becoming a radio sports announcer, Lembeck's path took a different turn. After serving in the U.S. Army during World War II and being discharged in 1945, he enrolled at New York University. His goal was to obtain a degree in radio arts, but fate had other plans for him. It was a fortuitous encounter with his instructor, Professor Robert Emerson, that changed everything. Professor Emerson recognized Lembeck's talent and urged him to pursue a career in the theater. Inspired and encouraged by his mentor, Lembeck made a bold decision to follow his passion for the stage. Embracing his instructor's advice, he traded the microphone for the spotlight and set off on a new path. As Lembeck embarked on his theatrical journey, it was essential to acknowledge his heritage. Being Jewish played an important role in shaping his identity and the characters he would later portray. His Jewish roots would provide a deep well of understanding and authenticity that would enrich his performances throughout his career. With the first act of his life coming to a close, Lembeck had laid the foundation for what would become a remarkable career in the entertainment industry. From a dancer at the World's Fair to a student at NYU, he had embraced the opportunities that came his way, ultimately finding his true calling on the stage. Do you want to explore more actors? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.